Are you ready for opening two of Upper Deck 2021 Series 1? Let's go. Super Fractor Cards is back with opening two. If you never watched my first video of uh, Series 1, just click up here, take a look. I hit a monster. That was a really hot box. Actually, before I open this one, just quickly, I was at Walmart last night and uh, there is retail product now out on the market. Um, this is obviously a hobby. This is a retail box. In these blasters, uh, you get six packs and you get the oversized young guns. And I happened to buy three boxes. I got a Connor McMichael young guns. A Nick Robertson Young Guns, and an Alexia Lafanaire Young Guns oversized. <clears throat> Probably the three best, uh, biggest Young Guns of the year so far. Um, two of them anyway. And the packages come in this configuration, whereas the hobbies come in an orange pack. So if you are buying loose packs, which I don't recommend, uh, and you want hobby, make sure they're the orange ones and not the retail size or uh, color like this. Anyway, that's just uh, some info for you guys. Let's uh, jump into this. I'm just gonna blast through each pack. There's one hit in each pack. We're looking for young guns, maybe some case hits. Um, Wouldn't mind hitting an upper deck UD exclusive young gun. Okay, well, there's not anything in here. So, oh, there you go. Debut date, uh, Kirby Dock. Um, <laughs> it's the second card like this. October 20th, 2019, his uh, debut was zero goals, zero assists, zero points, and minus one. So really, really uh, big game. I like that uh, Upper Deck has put in some different parallels in here, like the predominant cards and the dazzlers and the worldwides and these uh, debuts instead of the uh, last year's kind of inserts that were the same as always but connor garland ud canvas card but um not sure the debut cards are what I would want. Young Gun, Igor Zamula. I don't know much about him. Oh, we got a uh, Dazzler card in here. So Dazzler cards are one in 24 packs, so you get one in a box. Mitch Marner. And then there's a pink parallel where they're um, 144. Um, the debut dates are one in 20, so you possibly could get two in a box, but probably only one on average. Igor Korshkov. It's funny, two cards in a row that are Igor first names. <laughs> uh, and then there is a predominant card that when we hit that, they're one in 12. But you can get a gold parallel of those, which are one in 260, which uh, I'd like to see. There's a portraits card of uh, Liam Foodie. I really don't like the new portrait cards. 
I like the look of the old ones. Basically, they're worthless. They're just uh, an insert. Andre Borofsky, UD Canvas. Still looking for a French. Oh, there we go. We got uh, Timothy uh, Liljergren. Liljergren. Young Guns. Yeah, we're still looking for a French Young Guns. Or a French card in general. I think a French card would be, ooh, what do we have here? Okay, so I said I didn't really like the debut dates, but this is a debut dates um, jersey card of Morgan Frost. I did not know they had that. One goal, one assist. Or sorry, one goal, one point. That's uh, actually a nice looking card. Cool. Uh, on the sell sheet, I didn't see that there was jersey cards of debut dates. Nicholas Bowden, Young Guns. So this debut, is that a... You've received a trading card with Morgan Frost memorabilia that has been certified and worn by the feet by the featured player and they don't say game worn they just say worn so they put a couple jerseys on wore them for 10 minutes and cut them into pieces you know when i grew up jersey cards were huge now they're eh. ov portrait I know somebody that's going to want that Morgan Frost jersey card. There we go. A worldwide Tivu Teravayan. Teravayan. All right. I'm not uh, overly excited about what we've hit so far. Um, young guns aren't bad, but I'd like a big hit. Here, Joseph Wool. I am not aware of. He's in the AHL. Thirty-two games, eleven wins, sixteen losses, three point seven five games, six four two zero three. Hmm. That's five or is that six? That's five. We're still looking for one more. And a couple canvas cards. Patrick Liney, UD Canvas. Predominant card. So Kyle Connor, predominant. Um, that's the standard white background. The one thing I will say about this year's product is that the pictures are interesting. They, uh, I think they had to dig deep for pictures just due to the whole bubble and COVID. Oh, wow, look at this. Okay, so we got uh, the debut dates, Morgan Frost uh, jersey card, and then we got a Matt Dumba game, UD game jersey. So these ones were worn game jerseys. Game used, yep.
Anyway, as I was saying, the pictures are uh, interesting. There's a lot of Jake Evans young guns. Nice. Okay, so well, that's our six young guns. If we can maybe get uh, a UD canvas young guns. Nico Hishar, UD canvas. And I'm not sure if you get a French young gun, I'm not sure if that counts towards your six. Okay, rookie retrospect of Igor Shostrykin. Okay, well, we got five packs left, but we've hit pretty much everything guaranteed to hit. Okay, so. There we go. You see it says variant French. This is a uh, Yamamoto French variant card. So I think that's the first one I've hit so far. I'll probably go through the base again, but usually in a pack, if there's no young gun or insert, uh, that's a good example of, uh, or that's a good, good way of knowing that you're only getting a, a French card in there, but I'll take it. I'll probably take that over some of these inserts. And another re rookie retrospective of Mackenzie Blackwood. Three packs to go. Let's get a uh, UD exclusive of somebody or a high gloss, maybe. Portrait. Andre Fleury. So here's a good example. These pictures are uh, Malkin is on the ice. And Konechny, the one that he has, is he's laying on the ice. And uh, Tavares is laying on the ice. They just have some really interesting pictures this year. Oh, another debut date of Dominic Kubelik. Zero goals, zero assists, zero points on October 1st, 2019. There's another. So Pan Panarin, he's got his foot up in the air. I don't know if he's like jumping over the boards or what he's doing. Stamco sitting on the ice again. That's just some examples of some some of the cool pictures in this year's set. Okay, last pack. No idea what to expect in here. I think we've hit everything we're supposed to. Maybe a canvas? No. <sighs> Portraits card of Brock Nielsen. Okay, so... Uh, that's it, pretty underwhelming box actually. Um, if you watch the first version, first uh, opening, you'll notice uh, a pretty damn good box. This one was okay for the young guns, but everything else was kind of ho-hum. Uh, two Igors, a Timothy kid from uh, Toronto, uh, Bodan, Wall, Evans, uh, two jersey cards. One is a uh, Matt Dumba and the other one is a debut dates of Morgan Frost and then all of the uh, The inserts that you're supposed to get so thanks for watching uh, Leave a like leave a subscribe or hit subscribe definitely leave a comment down below um, Which box did you like better the first one or the second one? Thanks guys, bye